it's not financial advice, not legal advice. This this is life advice. This is life advice. Okay? And and let me tell you guys something. We all are going to form our opinions about things. That is how human beings operate. We see situations and we we come to conclusions. Okay? We come to conclusions. But at times even though you formed your opinion about something, even though you formed your opinion about something, when you get additional information, you have to have the courage to change your opinion if that additional information supports that. You have people that get additional information and even though the additional information is contrary to what they think, and additional information is correct, they still won't change their opinion because they don't have the courage to change their opinion. Okay? I felt that Robin Hood was complicit in the buy button that they did it in, in cahoots with Citadel. That's what I felt. Okay? And you guys know in my videos, I slammed Robin Hood for it. I slammed Citadel for it. Because that was the information that I had at the time. But since then, I have gotten additional information. And with that additional information, I have to change my opinion based on the evidence that's pre presented to me right now. If Robin Hood had not killed that buy button, with Citadel refusing to take the order flow, what would have happened? The entire Robinhood platform would have been crashed, would have been done. Robinhood would be no more. And everybody would have lost their money. Not just GME, not just AMC, everybody on that platform. So they made a decision that Citadel, in my opinion, forced Robinhood into. And you guys are going to call me a shill and, 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 and call me all kind of negativity that I'm seeing on the internet. And you guys are entitled to your opinion. I'm not mad at you for your opinion. But what I'm telling you is this. In life, and not just the stock market, in life, you can form an opinion. But when you get additional information, you have to have the courage to change your opinion based on that information. If you don't, then are you are you being honest with yourself or are you just forming an opinion to go along with the herd? Because if you get additional information and because you feel that that the the herd, the group is going to be upset with you because you change your opinion based on the additional information, then are you really an individual? No, no, you're a follower. You are a follower, okay? You have to make your decision based on the information that's provided to you. And if a majority of the people still feel a certain way, but the evidence showed you something else, you have to have the courage to say, listen, I understand and I respect how you feel, but the evidence tells me something different, okay? And the evidence tells me that Citadel forced Robin Hood into that situation because they refused to take the order flow, okay? And had Robin Hood not done it, the whole platform would have been done and everybody would have lost their money. That is my opinion. That is what the evidence tells me. And I know some people, not some people, a lot of people are going to be upset by it, but it is what it is. Okay, it is what it is. When you get additional information in life, you have to have the courage to change your opinion based on a new evidence that's presented to you. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that if you formed an opinion and you get additional information, you should have the courage to change your opinion based on that additional information? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.